Store-bought bread stays fresh for weeks, while homemade bread molds in three days. And the reason will make you never look at Wonder Bread the same way again. That fluffy loaf sitting in your pantry contains calcium propionate, a chemical preservative that literally embalms your bread. But here's the kicker. This same ingredient is used in fabric softeners, paint, and cosmetics to stop bacterial growth. Your sandwich bread has more in common with your moisturizer than actual food. Real bread is supposed to go bad. When mold and bacteria refuse to touch something, that should be a massive red flag about what it's doing inside your digestive system. I went down this rabbit hole after noticing my grandmother's homemade bread would mold overnight, but store bread could survive a nuclear apocalypse. Turns out, commercial bread isn't just preserved with calcium propionate. It's also loaded with dough conditioners, high fructose corn syrup, soybean oil, and about 15 other chemicals I can't pronounce. The bread industry has convinced us that longer shelf life equals better value. But when your food lasts longer than some medications, something is seriously fucked up. Traditional bread needs four ingredients, flour, water, salt, yeast, that's it. If your bread label reads like a chemistry experiment, you're not eating food you're eating a science project. Your great-grandmother would laugh at what we call bread today. She'd probably use it as a doorstop before putting it in her mouth. Real food spoils because it's actually alive. Dead food with preservatives might fill your stomach, but it's not nourishing your body. The truth is always hiding in that ingredient list.